Hello guys, well, what is up? My name is Dan the Delight and today I am bringing you an Andrew Robertson FIFA 23 Winter Wildcards player review. This is the left back from Scotland and Liverpool. Uh, paid 310k for him, so that's the price that I'll be reviewing him based off of. He is 5 foot 10, he has high, high work rates, left footed, and look at that, 5 star skill moves, 2 star weak foot, but the 5 star skill moves with a left back is quite fun to play with, I would imagine. 5 foot 10, and uh, decent height for headers as well, but 310k for a left back is a big chunk, so he's going to have to be good let's get into the in-game stats now and then some gameplay so 90 pace very very nice indeed absolutely what you want him for a left back 64 shooting doesn't matter too much he's a left back 85 passing is very good particularly that crossing at 90 if he's bombing forward that is very good to have 84 dribbling is really good as well um, particularly the balance and agility that means he's not going to be caught out and turning like a truck and that sort of thing 86 defending is very good to go with that pace you don't normally get High pace, high defending for a left or right back, so that is very, very welcomed and decent enough physical. 96 stamina, very good when he is going to be bombing up and down with that high, high work rate. So, very good looking card. Let's get in some gameplay now and see how it goes. All right, so let's see. I've got him playing on the uh, on the left back side over there. Literally, they're attacking it now. Uh, by the looks of things, this guy's better side is the left hand side. So hopefully that means that we'll be able to see uh, what Robertson's got. That is him that I'm controlling, number eighteen over there on the left back. Um, so of course I will play some more games with him. Here he is. Good pass. Um, before giving my sort of final verdict on him, but yeah, let's see what he's got oh nice turn that's what I wanted to see if his agility and balance were good his pace is fantastic here oh come on come on if he can get across here from and an assist this would be fantastic he gets the cross poor shot in the end there but that was really good play to uh, to start things off there very very happy with how Robertson has started um, very nice run indeed so yeah can't complain whatsoever let's have a look Bruno G Georgie Best uh, Bernardo, yeah, I mean, we're, we're in the attacking position now, so not really anything for Robertson to do. Hopefully we can get a win as well. Um, yeah, I mean, obviously the uh, the main thing that we want is to make sure that Robertson has a good game. There he is, player debut. This is literally my first half with him, so if you're watching this, it means he had a decent half. Um, yeah, or it was he offside? It didn't look offside to me, but yeah, he must have been, I guess. All right, let's see what he's got. Get him on a run. He is making a good burst in run. Can he beat his man? He can beat his man. And that's Trippier who is hard to beat. And he's beaten Poyo as well. Oh, just gets a foot in there right at the end there, Poyo. But really, really good from Robertson. Can he get back now? That's the question. Um, is he fast enough? He is seemingly. I think that Donovan is pretty quick. And um, yeah, Robertson has just caught straight up with him. He's probably going to, yeah, he scored anyway. That was, to be fair, my fault for making Robertson go forward. I did get left a bit short on the uh, left-hand side there, but I did definitely want to test out Robertson going forward. So, yeah, I don't regret it for the review. Of course, I want to win, um, but for, for the sake of testing out Robertson as, as much as I possibly can, that was a, a good thing to do. So, yeah, don't, uh, don't regret that at all. Got a free kick here. Uh, yeah, I don't know why you're shooting from there, pal. Never going to go in. Oh, got a bit of a, a lag going on there. Oh, that doesn't help, does it? <laughs> I think I'm blaming the lag for that one. All right, Bellis. Could a Barley get it out? Nakata. Where's Robertson? Oh, no. Terrible pass. And he's. Wow. That's 2 0. Uh, neither of them goals were Robertson's fault, so that's good at least. Uh, I'm trying to look for a silver line in here. Here he is. Come on, let's see what you got. Decent enough pass. He's making a good run there, and he's got away again. He is really good going forward. Oh, just again, Poyol gets the foot in. But yeah, he's very, very good at going forward. Not seen too much defensively from him because I haven't really had to um, over that side. But yeah, going forward, he has been brilliant, and that's a great pass. And George Best makes it 2 1. Very nice. I'm very happy with that. Um, I didn't want to get embarrassed here in this uh, in this first um, half with Robertson. Go on, Morientes is away, and that's it. We make it two two. Very very nice indeed. So it's just how quick things can change in FIFA is just ridiculous. All right, let's test out Robertson's defensive capabilities. Good turn from Donovan there. Very nice foot in there from Robertson. Completely, uh, com just. Yeah, you can't get much better of a tackle than that. Ooh, he's got Pele up top. I didn't realise that until 
just now rest in peace the king um yeah it's just terribly sad what what's happened there he literally is for me when when you think of football Pele comes to mind as being one of the first three players that you can think of so yeah a tremendous shame unfortunately um Nakata Bernardo didn't quite manage to get it to uh to this striker there Ozil nope and Donovan again away and that's another fantastic tackle from Robertson yeah he he's looking like the real deal hopefully this will continue in the next few games that I play with him but he is looking very good so far oh and again that one bounce over to the uh the opponent but yeah it was a good tackle from him initially there was just no one marking the uh, the other player that we had there but yeah i'm enjoying using robertson as a left back he had to be good for the price that you're paying for him um of course we'll see if he is actually worth it once we uh once we play some more games with him and at the end of this when i go back to the in-game stats and sort of review them stat by stat um, but yeah, Robertson at the moment is seeming to be a very, very solid left back for me, attacking and defensively. That's it, George Best. Oh, that was a bad pass. Should have timed that a little bit better. He was making a decent run. Oh, well, no, it was that as well. He was making a, a decent run, and I just rushed it a little bit and, and sort of passed it the wrong way. Always oh, done me there. That was on me, to be fair. I shouldn't have slid in like that. I did want to test out his thigh tackles, but it wasn't the right time to be doing that. So I don't blame Robertson uh, himself for that. That was just poor from me. And William Pope didn't have much to do there. And Eric Bay got a review on him on the channel as well. He's went to wildcard. Pretty much every player that I've got in this team, there's a review on. Go on, George. Can we make it three? Nah. Right, so I'm going to end it there. Um, he's had a very good half, Robertson, in this one. So I'm going to play some more games with him, and then we'll go back into the in-game stats and compare them to how he felt in the other games that I played with him. All right, so Robertson here. Look at this. Let's get into it stat by stat, and then I'll give my overall final verdict on if I think that he's worth 310k. So 90 pace, felt like 90 pace, maybe more. Actually, I'm going to increase his pace to 92. You saw him bursting forward, and then he burst right back as well. Really, really solid pace. Can't complain about that. 64 shooting, I'm not going to touch. He's a left back. He didn't have any shots for me. Passing at 85. I guess, yeah, we'll leave it at that. I, I wouldn't increase it. If anything, I might decrease it slightly, but 85 feels about right. I didn't really notice anything special. Um, 84 dribbling can be increased, um, especially when he was bombing forward. This dribbling was really, really good. He was beating players left, right, and center. So we'll bring it up to an 86. Defending at 86 also feels about right. Um, he, he has very solid defending, um, really, really good defending. And for a left back, you don't normally get that as much. So I'm very happy with that. And then 83 physical, I'll actually leave that as it is. His strength didn't feel great, but that stamina did. He like he was he had no red bar by the end of the game and he was up and down like anything so yeah we'll leave that at 83 purely because his strength was a little bit on the low side so we've increased the pace we've increased the dribbling and left everything else the same we haven't decreased anything so is he worth it it's a tough one for me because 310k for a left back is a lot of coins like that's over half of my coins gone um, so for me he wouldn't be worth it but he is the best left back that I've used so if you've got the coins to spare and you need a left back get him because he is the best left back that I've actually used but for me for plan 300k for a left back just isn't worth it unfortunately but for you it might be so hopefully this video has helped if it has please do give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button for more videos like this there will be a link in the description down below full of FIFA 23 player reviews as always guys thank you for watching